Original person, absolute truth that is described in the Vedanta Sutra, Janmadasya Jataha, original person just like in our family wise or Guru Parampara wise, there is somebody original person. So, Similarly, the whole creation, there is original person. In the Srimad Bhagavatam, it is said, Aham asan agre. Aham asam agre. In the Vedanta, Vedic literature, Eka Narayana asit. So, Eko Narayana Asi, that is original person. And Krishna says, Aham Agre Asi, 
ही द ओरिजिनल पर्स आद्यम यदि भगवद्गीता सी सेट परम ब्रह्म परम धाम पवित्रम परम भवा पुरुषम आद्यम तो कृष्णा इज द ओरिजिनल पर्स एंड इफ सामबाडी क्वेश्चन दैट इफ कृष्णा इज द ओरिजिनल पर्सन हु इज द ओरिजिन ऑफ कृष्णा नेचुरली we can ask that because our experience is different uh, that answer is there in the brahma samhita ishara parama krishna satyananda vigraha anadi adi uh, anadi adi he is adi adam purusham but if you question who is the cause of krishna anadi he has no cause that is god you go on searching after on after another i am my origin is my father my father's origin is his father his father's origin his father his father in this way you go on searching then come to brahma Brahma is Adi Kavi. In this material world, in this universe, Adi Kavi. Tene Brahma Rida Adi Kavi. So he is very Adi, original, first created being. Uh, then who is he is Adi? Where from Brahma is coming? Uh, uh, that is Krishna. तेने ब्रह्म रिदा आदि कवे सो इन दिस वे वेन वी कम टू कृष्णा मेकिंग ए ब्रह्मा इज कमिंग फ्रॉम विष्णु गर्भोद साई विष्णु स्वयंभू इज बॉन्ड ऑफ द लोटस फ्लावर दट गर्भोद साई विष्णु इज कमिंग फ्रॉम कारण दक्षाई विष्णु कारण दक्षाई विष्णु इज कमिंग फ्रॉम शंकर्षण शंकर्षण इज कमिंग फ्रॉम अनिरुद्ध अनिरुद्ध फ्रॉम प्रद्युम लाइक दैट अल्टीमेटली कृष्ण दैट फॉर कृष्ण इज आद्यम एंड कृष्ण से इज इन दगवदगीता मत परतरम नान्य There is no word. So there is God. You go on researching, researching, adhyam, adhyam, adhyam. When you come to a point, there is no more adhyam. So there is God. Ishara Parama Krishna Satchidananda Vigraha Anadi Radhi Govind Sarvakarana Karana Saiva That Adi Purush. that original person he comes down descends in this material world jeeva loka sa this is called jeeva loka this material is called jeeva loka because uh, here atma the soul is covered condition we have given the meaning jeeva loka means when the atma is conditioned that is called jeeva loka uh, ah yeah, here there is no freedom it's like there are so many planets you have got aeroplane uh, but because you have got aeroplane you cannot go there condition you cannot go they are trying <coughs> one two planets moon planet or mars planet no you cannot go there <coughs> what to speak of other planet if you want to go there then you have to qualify yourself uh, not that because you have got a machine you can go there no that is not possible 
therefore condition. Condition means you have to fulfill the condition. Just like from here, if I want to go to America, then I have to fulfill the condition. The visa condition, the passport condition, the health condition, the custom condition, so many conditions. You cannot go immediately. Or nobody can come from there also. In every respect we are conditioned. Every respect. This body is conditioned. You cannot enjoy this body unconditionally. No, that is not possible. You have to change. Dehi nasmin jatha dehi kaumarang jauvanang jara. Uh, the body has to be changed. A baby has to be changed to become a boy. A boy has to be changed to become a young man. Uh, a young man has to be changed to a old man. You cannot stop that. Therefore, it is called jivuluk, uh, condition. Every one of us is condition. <coughs> a um, animal is condition. Uh, uh, he cannot, there are so many animals in the jungles. They are conditioned. They cannot come in the city or in the town. We are conditioned. We cannot go to the jungle. Condition. Every state there is condition. Uh, so that is our bondage. We are Mamayvamsa Jiva Bhuta. We are part and parcel of Krishna. Why you are conditioned? Uh, the condition is because Maya Mahita Chita Sa. Maya Mahita. Uh, they are bewildered by Maya. Uh, Maya means what is not, māyā. So, because we are under the classes of māyā, this material world, therefore we have been conditioned. And what is that māyā? That māyā is forgetfulness of our relationship with God. That is māyā. Krishna Bhuliya Jeev Bhogavan Chakare. This is Jeev. When we forget Krishna, our relationship with Krishna, what is the relationship? Chaitanya Mahaprabhu says, Jivel Sarupai Nitya Krishna Das. That is our relationship. We are eternal servant of Krishna. When we forget this and we want to be master, uh, of all I survey, I am the monarch of all I survey. Uh, I think I shall become uh, independent and I shall enjoy, I shall improve my economic condition and I shall be very happy. This is called Maya Mohita Chetas. He uh, will never be because he is conditioned. You cannot improve, that is not possible. That is called destiny. Uh, so the uh, Western people, they mm, say, so why should we uh, animal take? You cannot improve the condition. Suppose the pig he is conditioned to live in a very filthy place and eat stool, urine, you cannot improve that condition. Uh, by philanthropic mentality, if you want to improve his condition, not to live in filthy place, not to eat uh, uh, stool, uh, if you try to give, give them uh, halwa instead of stool, they cannot. That is not possible. This is called condition. Uh, uh. Therefore, Shastra says that you are conditioned, you cannot change the condition. 
So there is no need of endeavoring for changing the condition. That is not possible. Uh, Devi Jesa Gunamai Mama Maya Durutvaya. Krishna says. Uh, Maya Mama Maya Durutvaya. It is not that. Suppose if you are in the prison house, uh, you are sacred. Uh, you cannot improve your condition. Uh, you must be sacred. Uh, you are put in a cell, you must live there. Similarly, this is useless effort. The so-called maya mahita chetasa, the whole material world is like that, they are trying to improve the condition. But that is not possible. Uh, therefore they are called maya mahita chetasa. Uh, <coughs> Simply, uh, he is thinking, that if I do like this, if I go a step forward, I shall improve my condition. No, that is not possible. Uh, again and again, uh, uh, they, they dis- describe in another place that nati vidu sārtha-gatiṁ hi viṣṇo durāsayāji bahiratthamānina andāyatha puna puna char vita char vanana matinna krishne parato sato ba mitho vipadita griha vrtana griha vrtana matinna krishne those have taken it a bhav that I shall remain in this family life and improve my condition griha vrtana griha vrta grihastha and grihabhrata, different. Grihastha means grihastha ashram. A man is living with husband and wife or children, but the aim is how to improve spiritual life. That is grihastha ashram. And one who has no such aim, he simply wants to enjoy the senses and for that purpose he is decorating the house, decorating the wife, children. That is called grihabhrata. Uh, or griham means he. In Sanskrit there are different terms for different many. So those who are grihabhrata, they cannot be Krishna conscious. Matinna Krishna parato satuva. Parato means by the instruction of guru or instruction of authority, parato. And satova, sata means uh, automatically. And automatically is not possible even by instruction. Uh, because his bhav is that I shall remain in this way, grihabhratana. Uh, Matinna krishne parato satova, mitho vipaddi, mitho. But by conference, by meeting, uh, by passing resolution, uh, if we uh, want to become Krishna conscious, that is not possible. Uh, it is all individual. Uh, I have to surrender to Krishna individually. Just like when you go to the sky on aeroplane, it is all individual. If one aeroplane is in danger, other aeroplane cannot save him. That is not possible. Similarly, it is all individual. Uh, it is not parato sato va. Uh, one has to take it seriously, personally, that Krishna <coughs> wants, so I will surrender. Krishna says, Sarvadharman paritraja mami kang saranang vaja. So I will do it. Uh, not that when my father will do, then I shall do, or my husband will do, then I shall do, or my wife will do. No. It is all individual. It is all individual. And there is no restraint. Uh, there is no restraint. Ohitoki aprati hata. If you want to surrender to Krishna, nobody can check it. When you do that individually, uh, if you 
collectively, if it is done, it is good. But uh, it has to be done individually. Uh, so, because every one of us are maya mahita chita. Uh, maya mahita chita. Mullah Maharaj has described uh, bimukha chita sa. Maya mahita chita sa means averse to Krishna. I want everything except Krishna. That is Maya Mahita I want everything but except Krishna. Uh, that is my missing point. Because we are rascal fools, uh, we do not know what we should want. Nate Vidu Sat Gating He Vishnu. He does not know that his actual want is Krishna. It's like a small child crying. And we are trying to pacify him, giving this, giving that. Uh, but he is crying, crying, because his actual want is his mother. And as soon as the mother comes, takes the child on the lap immediately. He stops. Similarly, we want Krishna, because we are part and parcel of Krishna. Uh, that we want. Uh, just like a part and parcel of a machine, uh, if it is taken away from the machine, it is no, you want a screw. Suppose your typewriter machine, uh, one screw is missing and the machine is not working nicely. So without the machine, that one screw has no value. Uh, if it is lying somewhere, one does not know what is the screw, nobody cares for it. It is no worth. But if you want to uh, complete the machine, if you want to go to purchase it in a mechanical saw, that very screw which has no value, you have to purchase a ten rupees. Uh, because it is to be fit up. Uh, in this way, we are parcel and parcel of Krishna, part and parcel of Krishna. When we are along with Krishna, we have got value. Otherwise, there is no value. Uh, there are so many examples. This finger, when it is attached to the body, if there is any trouble, you can spend thousands of rupees to cure the trouble. But if the finger is cut off, amputated, and thrown on the street, it is no value. No value. Uh, similarly, so long we are Maya Mahita Chetasa, out of Krishna's touch, we have no value. No value. Valueless. Useless. That is our position. Krishna Paratu Satoba. Mitho. The uh, position is that adanta govi visatang tamisram. When we forget Krishna, what is that forgetfulness? When you are interested in sense gratification, that is called forgetfulness. Everyone is, even a, an animal, a small insect, everyone is interested in sense enjoyment. Uh, just this morning I was reading in the Bhagavata, one Sovari Muni, Muni, he was a great yogi, uh, and uh, within the water he was executing the yoga mystic, and he saw that the two fishes are enjoying sex. So he became sexually inclined, old man, yogi. Uh, so he went to Mandata king that, uh, you give me one daughter, uh, your daughter. So he was within the water, old man, and uh, old man's bodily feature is not very good. The king knew that this is a useless person, but he is a yogi. He has come to ask me for a daughter. 
So he said that, uh, yes, you are welcome. Uh, I have got my fifty daughters. So anyone will like you, he can accept. I have no objection. So Sahuri Muni understood that the king has tactfully avoided to give his daughter. So he was a yogi. So he made himself very beautiful young man. Uh, that yogi can do that. Uh, they can change because it, we are not this body. The so body is old. It can be younger, younger, but it can be older. Uh, nowadays in medical science they are also doing. A man, a old man, old man is man. Uh, <coughs> body can be changed. There is no difficulty if you know the process. Uh, so he said to be very nice, beautiful young man. So all the fifty daughters, they become attracted. Uh, they began to fight. Oh, he is for me. He is he's not for you. So anyway, uh, he accepted all the fifty daughters. Uh, in this way, he became very elevated householder. But at some time he began to think, what is my this enjoyment? Uh, simply by seeing the sex appears of the feast, uh, I was a yogi, I was a tapasi, I have lost everything. Now I am a householder and pet husband of this woman. Uh, so he came to his senses. Again he went to the forest for tapasya. So this material life, however opulent it may be, it is māyā mahita chetas. It is no value. Uh, it has no value. Why? Because in this life I may be very favorably situated uh, by arrangement, by uh, I mean, improving my material condition. But after death, dehantara prapti, you do not know, we do not know what kind of body we are going to get. It may not be as comfortable. Uh, the Kurmis, uh, they, those who are uh, little advanced uh, than the ordinary foolish persons, uh, there are, first of all, ordinary foolish person means animals. They are just like animals. Uh, a little above that, they are Kurmis. A little above that, there are Gyanis. A little above that, there is Yogis. And above all of them is the bhakti. Uh, that the bhakti life is the samambona of life. Uh, so Krishna comes here, saiva jiva lukasya maya mahita chetasa vidhase sena vidjena. Krishna comes down. It is said in the Bhagavad Gita also, jada jada hi dharma sagrani. Uh, the dharma is, uh, <coughs> I am servant of Krishna. That is my position. Dharma means characteristic. Uh, just like sugar has to become sweet, that is dharma. A chili has to be hot. A sugar, if it is chili taste, is useless. A chili is sweet taste, it is useless. So this test of a particular thing is called dharma. Uh, <clears throat> so this dharma, according to the body, is developed in this material world. But the original dharma, original is the spirit soul. That spirit soul is the part and parcel of Krishna, and his duty is to serve Krishna. That is original dharma. So, in order to teach that original dharma, Krishna comes. Jada-jadahi dharma sa glani bhavati. Glani means discipline. When one, when the conditioned soul is by the influence of maya, is engaged in sense gratification, that is called dharma sa glani. Uh, jada-jadahi, just like nowadays, 
nobody is interested uh, the so called educated or advanced man if we say that you have to serve krishna this is not your duty you are going to the office and earning daily 5000 rupees uh, that is simply useless uh, the useless it is simply waste of energy who will believe it no uh, the This is a nonsense proposal. Uh, but Shastra says that dharma sāna sthita pumsa vishyakshena katha suja nutpāda yadarati yadi samayi vahi kevalam. You are doing your duty very nicely. Uh, your dharma means an occupational duty. Suppose you are an engineer. You are doing duty very nicely. Or a medical man, or a business man, or anyone. Everyone has to do something. You cannot uh, sit down idly and you, you get your livelihood. Even if you are a lion, you have to work. Nahi shukta sashinga sa prabhisanti mukhe mriga. This is the material world is like that. Even if you are as powerful as a lion, you cannot sleep. If you think I am lion, I am the king of the forest. Let me sleep, and the animal will come and enter in my mouth. No, that is not possible. Uh, even if you are animal, you have to catch up the animal. Then you will be able to eat. Otherwise, you have to starve. Uh, therefore, Krishna says, "Niyata kuru karma tam karma jayo akarma na." You must do your duty. शरीर यात्रा भी थे ना प्रसिद्ध थे तपन डोंट थिंक दिस एस्केप से द कृष्ण कॉन्शियसनेस मूवमेंट इज टीचिंग पीपल टू एस्केप दैट बी कैम नो दैट इज नॉट कृष्ण इन स्टक्स वी डू नॉट अलाउ एनी लेजी मैन ही मस्ट बी एनगेज दैट इज कृष्ण कॉन्शियसनेस दैट इज कृष्ण ऑर्डर नियत कुरु कर्म Uh, Arjun was refusing to fight. He was trying to be non-violent gentleman. Uh, Krishna did not allow him. No, no, you cannot do that. That is your weakness. Kutaste kasmala medam bishami sam. You are proving yourself rascal. Uh, it is onarjo justa. This kind of proposal is for the onarjo, uncivilized man. Don't do that. That is Krishna. So don't think that Krishna consciousness movement, those who are Krishna conscious, they will <coughs> become lazy and imitate uh, Haridas Thakur. Uh, that is not Krishna consciousness. Uh, Krishna consciousness means, as Krishna in the stars, you must be very, very busy, twenty-four hours. That is Krishna consciousness. Uh, not to become a lazy fellow, eat and sleep. Uh, no, so uh, this is dharma sakhlani. But you have to change your angle of vision. In the material condition life, your aim is how to satisfy your senses. And Krishna consciousness means you have to work in the same spirit, same vigor, but you have to satisfy Krishna. That is spiritual life. Not that to become lazy fellow. Uh, the difference is, uh, as it is said by uh, author Krishna Das, Atmendriya Tripti Mancha Taranam Kam. What is Kam? Kam means when one desires to satisfy his own senses. That is Kam. Krishna Driya Tripti Mancha Dhore Prem Na. And what is prem? Prem means when you engage to uh, yourself for satisfying Krishna's senses. Uh, why gopis are exalted? Because their only endeavor was to satisfy Krishna's senses. Uh, therefore, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu recommended: "Rama ka chidu pasana, prajapadhu vargavija kalipita." They had no other business. Vrindavan means those who are in Vrindavan. There, if, if there actually 
wants to live in Vrindavan, uh, their business would be how to satisfy the senses of Krishna. That is Vrindavan. And not that uh, I am living in Vrindavan and trying to satisfy my senses. That is not Vrindavan uh, uh, <coughs> That kind of uh, living is, there are so many monkeys, dogs, and hawks also, they are in Vrindavan. Do you mean to say that they are um, living in Vrindavan? No. Uh, so, well, anyone who wants to satisfy senses in Vrindavan, uh, their next life is dogs, hawks, and monkey. Uh, you must know that. Uh, so one should not uh, try to uh, sense gratify in Vrindavan. That's a great sin. Uh, simply try to satisfy Krishna's sense. Sarvapadi binin muktam tat paratena ninmalam rishikena rishikesa sevanam bhakti ruchyate. That is bhakti. Rishikena rishikesa sevanam. So, in order to teach this lesson to us, the condition so, jiva loga, Krishna vidhase sena vidjena by his own potency. Uh, one potency means if you surrender to Krishna, he has got such potency, he can deliver you from this conditioned life, jivan. He can make you purified, uh, pure mukti, that is called mukti. When you are free from this conditioned state, uh, this bodily conception of life, then you become free. Uh, simply by understanding Krishna. Janma Kanman Sati Bhamme Jo Janati Tattva Takta Deham Punar Janma After giving up this body, uh, he does not get any more of this material body. Then what happens to him? Takta Deham Punar Janma Naiti Mameti. Krishna comes to call you back. So he comes back. If you take Krishna's instruction, you go back to Krishna uh, and again you become happy. Otherwise, Maya Mohita Chetasa, you will have to suffer life after life. Thank you very much.